So in this video, uh, after watching it, you'll understand the chemistry for the amino acyl tRNA synthetases. And the synthetases, they, they are a, a collection, a family of enzymes that all catalyze this this, uh, this this set of reactions, and they they are the keepers of the genetic code, meaning each individual member in this family can identify the correct amino acid uh, based on its R group, and it can also make a match uh, with uh, to chemically link that amino acid to a particular tRNA that's able to decode the codons for that amino acid. We're just gonna write out the chemistry generally, that they all catalyze the same chemistry, but the R group and the, the precise tRNA used in the reactions will be different for each tRNA synthetase. And there has to be at least 20 of these synthetases, each one uh, catalyzing this set of reactions. We'll begin by looking at the chemical structure of amino acid with its carboxylate functional group alpha carbon, um, side chain, and amino, amino group. And we need, to, we need to activate the chemical potential energy of this carboxylate in order to make peptide bonds. Uh, and we couple, we, we couple this activation to the destruction of ATP. So ATP is the second substrate for this, this reaction and we make the adenylated form of the amino acid. And that means that we have here the structure of the amino acid, positive charge here, with its particular R group. And we've joined that to the structure of AMP. So the AMP molecule is attached chemically through an acid anhydride uh, linkage of a phosphoric acid and a carboxylic acid linked together. There's a lot of energy in this bond, ample energy for driving the synthesis of pe peptide bonds. And uh, so that's, that's the, the, activate, the initial activating group. This whole thing is called the amino acyl adenylate. And it's just an intermediate. Uh, we, we still cannot use this for making peptide bonds because we have no way to decode the codons. So the next thing that comes, uh, the next reaction, also catalyzed by the, the, TR, the amino acyl tRNA synthetase, is uh, that we need uh, to join the structure of the amino acid to, to the, the, the tRNA. And I'm gonna use a sketch that looks like this with a three prime OH group and that anticodon. And the tRNA synthetase knows uh, and can differentiate uh, the cognate tRNA from all the other possible tRNA that can act as substrates. And this, this is going to become part of the chemical structure and we're going to release as product AMP. So this, this unit right here is, is going to be the, the leaving group in this neck in the second reaction. And we create the amino acyl tRNA by prime. And we see here that the the uh, there's there's now an acyl linkage uh, between the what used to be the carboxylic acid functional group of the amino acid and the alcohol functional group, the three prime, the three prime end of the, of the tRNA. And this uh, amino acyl tRNA, amino acyl tRNA is what is used as a substrate for peptide bond synthesis at the, uh, at the ribosome.